I want to introduce you to Dean Bennett. He knows firsthand how difficult it can be to transition from active duty to civilian life after combat. He calls them his invisible injuries, and inside this gym, he's determined to help others thrive. Dean Bennett knows the meaning of hard work. Born in California, a multi-sport athlete growing up, enlisted in the Marines when I was 18. Sergeant Bennett survived several combat tours in Afghanistan, returning with PTSD and a traumatic brain injury. Losing fellow service members to suicide and combat injuries was extremely tough. Having friends be killed in action, um, seeing friends come home with permanent physical, mental, psychological injuries, um, having experienced combat myself, um, IED exposures, gunfights. Um, it, it definitely takes a toll on you, changes you, it forces you to mature and grow up really quickly. Beside this one was my roommate who uh, was killed. He connected with the nonprofit Semper Fi and America's Fund. They provide him with emotional support and financial assistance, guiding him from active duty service and healing through fitness. Definitely, yeah. They, they, I mean, they hold me accountable. They, they don't let me slack, so um, I expect nothing less from them. With support from the fund's apprenticeship program, Bennett opened Direct Action Athletics in Mechanicsville to help others like him with PTSD through exercise and camaraderie. And what I found with that was the ability to, one, burn off some of that extra energy, that, that need for an adrenaline rush, the need for a community, camaraderie, support um, of like-minded individuals to feel like you're not alone and you don't have to isolate and you don't have to tackle these problems all by yourself. Bennett tells me his journey is not over just yet. Later this year, he plans to share his story at veterans event and fitness seminars. In Hanover County, I'm Brendan King, CBS 6 News.